Very well. Aspiration. Whoa. Look at that. With the snake entrance. Jeez. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. <laughs> Hey, let's go. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. What? Bro, are you kidding me? Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. All right. It's a little more um, rough around the edges than... Uh, it's lovely to meet you. Uh, Professor, Professor Weasley. Weasley. Would you be so kind as to show our new students this to their... This is Ron's class? grandmother. Great-grandmother. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. All right, I'm going to move my head over because uh, the spells and everything are actually on the right side, not the left in this game, which is uh, different than the normal. That's one say. I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order Ooh, to enter, one must see the common room, sick. password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. Whoa. Look at that. With the snake entrance. Jeez. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. All right, nothing like a time shift. <laughs> Get to look around Hogwarts now, I assume. Or the Slytherin common rooms. Looks like everyone's gone. Let's head to the common room. Revelio. Anything secret here? Got a mini map that I can explore from the looks of it. So this is where my bed is. Got a common room of four. Damn, I really like the green. Looks nice. All right, I'm heading down this way, I guess. I suppose some introductions are in order. Yeah, I should probably say hi to a couple people. Must be different starting Hogwarts in your fifth year. Wonder where they're from. They're lucky they didn't end up as dragon fruit. Did you see the way they just waltzed in at the end of the sorting therapy? <laughs> Oh, nice. Some uh, free cashews. Love to see it. Love to see it. All right. Let's go talk to this guy, Sebastian Salo. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth <laughs> I just nodded him. I I'm don't Sebastian even like Salo. say anything. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs who merely joined us for the ride. Still impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was exciting. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. What are you reading? What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough. 
But not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Spicy. What do you mean? Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? Which ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. Mm. You might be the dark you. hearts guy. Good luck today. <laughs> okay. Wow. Damn, I really like the vibes of this common room. Some chess boards. A skeleton of a pterodactyl, sick. Got some dinosaurs. <laughs> it looks like it's underwater almost, it's so cool. Oh, it is underwater, that's sick. Wow, so this is in like the basement of the castle. Ominous yes. Gaunt. I, I think I heard one. A Grendelo. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. Well, you certainly had a memorable arrival. I do like to make an entrance. Well, <laughs> if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. Do mermaids often appear outside the common room? Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Did you suspect you'd be in Slytherin? Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status, a pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Oh. Okay, so he looks like he's a functional Slytherin. That's good to know. Thank you, Ominous. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't be a stranger. All right, definitely a fascinating guy. I don't know why he's just standing in the corner Hi, like that, Hi, but... Melda Race. <laughs> Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills in a broom are legendary. <laughs> I wish you had been there. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you fly a lot? Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? <laughs> Farewell. Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. All right. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley Violet is waiting for you just by the stairs. Okay, thank you. Appreciate the uh, heads up. Revelio. I wonder if there's any secret things in here. <sighs> Doesn't look like it. Oh, I like it. It's like the stairwell to Atlantis. Very cool theme. I never really like thought it would be like more of a water theme, but I guess it is. It's cool. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? 
Owls. Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Ooh, a book. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. All right, I'll take it. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? 